Hey everybody, this is Don over at Johnny's Used Cars. Voted the best place to buy a car in Okinawa by the military community of Okinawa. Today I'm sure there's 2014 uh, Toyota Paso. It's got 70,000 kilometers on it, which is about 43,000 miles. About 44. Um, before we get started, I'd like to let you know that we do have on a lot di uh, discounts. So the price you're seeing on the website right now will not be the final price when you come on a lot. Also, if you're arriving in Okinawa soon or you just arrived, Please make sure you stop by Johnny's Z's Cars as soon as you can and have a look around. Even before you get yourself a driver's license, there are benefits to doing it that way. So with that, let's going to have a look around. I'll show you the features inside. But first, I'd like to ask you to please watch the video until the end. I do go over a lot of information in my videos. going to answer a lot of your questions. Things like the JCI, the warranty, the financing. I cover all that and more. So please bear with me until the end. You have all the answers. If not, please contact me or stop on by. This Toyota Paso is a five-passenger vehicle in the 500 series category. So the mid-size category. Road tax per year is going to be 7,500 yen, which is about $55 right now with the current exchange rate. Road tax is due every April, May time frame. So we're going to take care of it for you this year. You won't have to worry about it until next. Now you do have uh, two options to pay for it. First one being US dollars cash outright, which could get you a larger discount. Or you can take advantage of 0% financing for 24 months with zero down. Yes, we don't have a down payment requirement, but if you want something down, reduce your overall monthly payments, you can. A lot of our customers do like 500 to 1,000. Some do half, some do more. Up to you. Before we go inside, I was like showing the rain guards. Rain guards will allow you to roll your windows down a little bit this way. If it rains, it's not going to get wet inside. More important feature benefit is it's going to be a cross ventilation. Get that extremely hot air out. And always get yourself a good windshield visor. All right, so with that, let's jump on inside. Got semi, semi uh, shag carpet in here. All right. Uh, key fob on your person, you can just crank this over as if the key was in there. If this key fob battery dies, you are able to take this out and insert it into the ignition there. So I'm just going to leave that right up here for now. All right. All right, 70,552 on the odometer. Uh, showed a couple of warning lights. Uh, that green one right there, that's your temperature gauge. So it's gonna be light green when the engine's cool. When the uh, engine warms up, it's gonna go away. But then I think you see the silhouette to the top left. That's gonna be red if it's overheating. Be on the lookout for that. The one right below that, that circular one, is your emergency brake. This one's a kick type, so uh, kick it, disengage it. Kick it again, and it engages. Um, and then that one, obviously, your seatbelt one. Make sure you wear your seatbelts. They do give tickets on and off base. Now, I'm pretty sure you can see most of the silhouettes. Anything pop up, pops up on the dash while you're driving, please pull over and find out what it is, take the necessary action. Other than that, just a very simple, straightforward, straight ahead instrument cluster. Off the left here, you have your radio, your shifter, your uh, air conditioning controls, little pocket here for storage. You got your um, power outlet and a grocery bag hook. That's up to three kilograms. That's about uh, six and a half pounds. And then cup holders. All right, doesn't have a traditional glove box, you just have that area for storage, and then a little bit of storage and cup holder on each door panel. That is your passenger space over there, you got your red roof flare hanging out, and this is the space I have on my side. The seat is, well, yeah, the seat is all the way back, all the way down. I have 511, as everybody loves knowing. Um, I'm comfortable right where I am. It does have a center armrest slash console that's gonna give a little extra space, and you can flip this up out of the way if you want to. Let's go eye level. That's my eye level right there. Really can't see anything past the windshield wipers like on most vehicles. I like to take this time to show you the auction sheet, showing you that this is a non-accident vehicle from mainland Japan. Please keep that in mind, non-accident vehicle from mainland. Well, these other dealers out here can't tell you that. We can on all our cars. And some will actually try to discredit this. Stop by, we'll explain why. This is graded 3.5 from the auction. And uh, with a B, I'm pretty sure that's an overall rating. Uh, uh, typically the, the one on the right is for the interior, so I'm not sure why they didn't put the exterior one. But it's a pretty good grade, really good shape, and I'm going to leave that up here on the sun, uh, driver's side on the sun, sun visor. I'm going to show you a couple other things before we go to the back seat. On the right side here, you do have your uh, your mirror controls. Uh, this one right here, that's to control the angle of your headlights. So maybe it's a foggy morning, you want to see the street a little better, that's where you're going to do it. And then this is idling off, so when you had a stoplight, it'll actually turn the engine off. I'm not a big fan of this during the summertime because when the summertime, obviously going to be hot, it's going to warm the car up. And then once you start going again, then you got to cool down the warm air uh, again. So I'm not a big fan of that during the summertime. All right. And then you have your uh, your uh, windows and door lock controls right here. Okay. Let's uh, turn this off. And then you have your um, uh, ETC reader right here. That's your electronic toll collector. This works like easy pass in the States if you're able to get the card for it for the expressway. And then right below that, you have your hood release. And please don't forget down here, you have your gas cover release. All right. With that, let's go to the back. This is the first time we had this color. It's actually a pretty cool color. All right. All right. The seat all the way back, all the way down, about an inch away from the back seat to my knees. Nothing as far as storage on the back of the driver's seat, but you have pocket storage on the back of the passenger seat. 
as always be careful what you put in there you don't want to rip it on each side and then nothing as far as storage on the door panels and no center console or anything else like that so pretty basic back here oh i should mention if you want to put the seats down and you want them flat there is a tab here and a tab there hopefully you can see that you're going to pull this out this is going to come up and down and then you can put the seat flat all right here's your rear space then if you do it now, all you're going to do is lift this up and go down. If you do it without doing that first step, it's, it's going to have an angle on it. It's going to go upward. It's not going to lay uh, completely flat. Go up here, show you the engine compartment. They're going to wrap this video up. All right, there you have it. You go one liter engine, nice and clean. All right. All right, there you go. Uh, 2014 Toyota Paso. Uh, 70,000 kilometers on it, again, about 44,000 miles. Military price goes down to 5,400. Additional military discount will get it down to 5,200. Again, while you're here, please ask the information guy about on a lot discounts, and you will get a lower price on this. But for now, the 5,200 is going to include a two-year JCI, the one-year bumper-to-bumper full warranty, the 2023 road tax, and a 10% sales tax is already included. Only thing on top would be the American insurance requirement, whether you go liability or full coverage, which is totally up to you, and we can assist, uh, assist you with that here. Touching on these warranties real quick. Yes, there are two-year warranties out here. However, they're not the best thing since sliced bread, so don't be fooled by them. Stop by, we'll explain why. But we do encourage you to shop around, go to the dealer, see what they have, check out the condition, mileage, and pricing of their vehicles. Then stop by Johnny's Used Cars, let us show what we have, what our program's all about, and how we're going to assist you. We are definitely making a difference out here because we are different. Stop, um, one of the many reasons why we did win the Sergeant Stripes Best Specific Magazines, Best Place to Buy a Car in Okinawa Award. Stop by, we'll show you why, like we have many, many others. So don't forget two ways to pay for it, US dollars cash out rate, or take advantage of 0% financing for 24 months. Either way, we're good to go. Thank you very much for watching. Take care. Hope to see you soon.